You've seen it, you've smelled it, and you probably already love it. Auntie Anne's pretzels are an irresistible treat. I'm here with Ann Gettings at the Yum Sugar Test Kitchen at Surfa's. We're gonna show you how to make Auntie Anne's pretzels at home. So Ann, how do we start? First of all, preheat the oven to 425 degrees. Next, you make the dough. If you'd rather make a pretzel from scratch, check out yumsugar.com for a recipe. Or to make it even easier, Auntie Anne's has an at-home baking kit. This dough has been rising for about 30 minutes now. Now we construct the pretzel. Place a non-stick spray in the area where you will place the dough. And then you want to cut an area about one and a half inches wide and about eight inches long. Cut, stretch, and roll. You want to start kind of at the middle. Okay. Is this about right? Uh-huh. Okay. About Ooh. a half an inch by 36 inches. And now we're going to twist the pretzel. We're going to try the lasso method. Okay. Lift it up, uh -huh. left hand still, lasso, and then pinch. So your right hand is really only just toes. going like this? Only your right hand, okay. and one time around. After it goes around once, then drop it, and that will stop the um, twirling. One, two, three. Drop. That was really good, <laughs> really good. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Oh, and then, and then stick, we call these the toes. Stick the toes on the end. Do you want me to show you a more kid-friendly way? Absolutely. Make a U. Pick up your ends. Twist them around once. Twist them around again. And then put, stick your toes to the end of the pretzel. Beautiful, oh, Susanna. That wasn't too hard. After we've made the pretzels, we dip them in a dip solution made of baking soda and hot water. The dip solution helps the pretzels to brown evenly. Grab the pretzels by the toes, dip them in the water, let them rest shortly on a towel, and then place them on the cookie sheet that's already been sprayed with the nonstick spray. What do we do next? Bake them at 425 degrees for eight to 10 minutes. Place them in the center rack in your oven. Rotate them once after five minutes, 180 degrees, and bake them two to five more minutes. This is my favorite part. Smell those. We need to brush the butter, brush butter on each of the pretzels, and then we're going to top the sweet with cinnamon sugar. Sprinkle it on, depending on how much you want. I I'm gonna go little, pretty liberally. I would How's yeah, that? be generous with the cinnamon sugar. Are you ready to try one? It's my favorite moment. Okay. Watch out, they're hot. Which do you want? Ooh, I gotta go with savory. And I'm having my favorite cinnamon sugar. What do you think? I could eat that all day long. It's just the perfect combination. It is the perfect combination. Thank you so much for showing me how to make an Auntie Anne's pretzel. This has been fun. Let's do it again. Okay. Thanks for watching and see you next time for another taste of Yum Sugar TV.